I'm in the I'm in the emergency room. You take your mom to the hospital. She passed out. What? What? Oh, she passed out. Yeah, she's well, not hey, doing well. Yeah, I got uh, Russell from Orange Pranks on the other line. Hey, sir, how you doing? I'm the guy that your uh, son put up to this little uh, joke. Is is your wife is your wife okay? She, she's in the hospital right now. What did you do to her? What'd you say? Is 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 it like uh like did, did she is she okay? Is she, I know she's in the hospital now, but most importantly, like is she doing okay? Like obviously that's a concern of ours. I don't know. They they got they got like things up hooked up to her right now. They're, they're, the doctors are, are monitoring right now. I got gotcha. you. Are you joking with us by any chance? Just want to like make sure this is serious. <laughs> no, no. I can't, I, you called my wife earlier, and now I'm in the hospital. What the what the heck? Okay, well, and, and, and assuming you're being serious, just to give you a quick, uh, some quick context, I called her pretending to be uh, Pedro, the father of the girl that your son has been talking to that he met online, and I ultimately alluded to the fact that, that Zachary got her pregnant, and that's why she was like freaking out and confused, but so far, she obviously... Oh like, my gosh, what is going on? Well, obviously, no. Nobody expected to work her up to that degree. Obviously, I had no idea that, like, you know, she would freak out that much. But um, we were hoping to like talk to her and, you know, make, let her know by the end of today that it was all joke and that nothing, this is not not actually happening. And put it was all in. joke. Wait, but you know, you oh don't have. Oh my ha gosh! Yeah, you you put my wife in the hospital. So, are you next to her right now? No, I'm in the emergency room. They they got her back in, in, in bed right now. I is she like I understand if she may have if she may have fainted but is she is she responsive is she talking to you is she okay like what they they said something about blood pressure I don't know I'm, I'm waiting to hear back from the doctors I'm so sorry dad I I really thought you know it wasn't you know I it was really just a joke I'm not joking with you guys I'm messing with you okay. oh my god that's, dude, oh my wait, god dude, I fucking, dad I fucking hate you I I honestly I wait hold on is she in is she in on it or does she still not know. No, she knows now. Oh. <laughs> she tried calling Zach oh, and my everybody God. else. Here she is. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Oh, no. I just woke up from my... <laughs> you're you're going to be a grandmother! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who can play this game? Let me tell you. You know, honestly, I was just a little bit worried. You know, just a little I mean, bit worried. You know, we, were, we were all concerned. We all have hearts here. When your husband was saying you're in the hospital, I, I couldn't tell if he was joking. Part of me was like, "Is he messing with us?" But I was like, well, "If it's serious," and I'm, I take it jokingly. It's super insensitive. So I'm sitting here like wondering, like how to approach it. Um, <laughs> Uh, well, please understand, when you call me the first time and I'm laughing my head off, it's because my son always calls with these weird, out-of-the-world voices trying to pretend and play us, and I thought, yeah, okay. Uh -huh. you know? I but got then it. you started making me believe, and I thought, crap, oh my gosh, what is going on? And da -da -da. That was then my husband is in his office, and he's laughing, and I thought, what's going on? And then I looked at the text and I said, aha. So I told my mother, <laughs> I said, Mom, I need a professional to help me pull this off. <laughs> So, <laughs> well, anyway. well, I guess it's only fair. I guess I can't be too mad if you tried to like reverse the brink. I guess I can only respect your efforts. <laughs> what were you assuming, <laughs> assuming you got a hold of Zach immediately afterwards? What were you going to say? Like, I, I was so curious, wondering if you were like going to yell at him, like, what are you thinking? Or like, wh what was going to happen? Well, I mean, I was still torn between is this a joke or is this really real? I was leaning more towards, okay, maybe this could very well be real because, you know, but um, I probably wouldn't have yelled at him right away unless the answer was, oh, yeah, Mom, by the way. But I probably would have been very stern as to, uh, I just got a phone call. Do you know who oh. I just got a phone call from? Oh, man. <laughs> I wish, I wish that happened. We probably would have went that route with it. That's that's. So, but no, no I, I probably would have killed him if they would have said, hey, uh, I just found out from the woman's father, and I knew nothing about you even seeing each other. <laughs> so, oh my god! That probably I would have. Zach and I were talking about like how he was going to approach you, and he was going to kind of go the route of like, "Mom, you know, I looked into it. Like, I just don't think I'm ready to have a baby. Can you tell Pedro that, like <laughs> just to keep the baby himself and like?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that wouldn't happen. <laughs> <laughs>
Um, so, but uh, no, I'm I'm glad you took it well too, sir. It's well, uh, but you know, my my son likes to do that, and I thought, you know, what would be some way to get back at him <laughs> for a change? Because mommy's honestly, always getting it on this end. Yeah, I know. I could tell Zachary was getting like super confused. He's like, Dad, I'm, I'm I'm so sorry. It's like, what is he going to say? Obviously, he doesn't want to disappoint me. He obviously he last thing was he wanted for you to end up in the hospital because of it. And we were just like the two of us were sitting here like, what's happening? I didn't know honestly how to react. I was I was super. <laughs> So, from my understanding, you called, like, someone's aunt was called, and was that the person that was in on it, or did you call the aunt, like, actually freaking out? After I got done with you, I tried Zachary several times, and of course, that thing that didn't answer. So, I called my sister-in-law, and I asked her if he was at work today, and she said, yeah, and I said, well, tell him I need to talk to him. And my mom's a great prankster, and I said, Mom, I need you to call... Zachary, and I told her everything that had happened, and of course she's dying laughing, and uh, I said, but this is what I want to do, Mom. I'm tired of being on the receiving end. Oh and she goes, okay. She uh, left uh, Zachary the message to call his dad. One more question. What did you think about, like, the, the fun? Did you remember the, the hickey line where I was like, yeah, he was doing something with her neck. Hey, Sylvia, what, what do you call it, Sylvia? Oh, hey. Yeah, well, you know, that one threw me off because I thought, why would this why do you even bother to tell me that? That's like TMI. You know? It's like, oh, for me. Uh, I for me. I didn't need to know that. But uh, I didn't really know why you would go there, other than the fact that you said the wedding and the baby. Uh-huh. I was like, I can understand that, but yeah. right, are, and, you, are, and, you, are you about to tell me something that I don't need to know? That's hilarious. Well, well, at any point, like, I screamed. I think I screamed, you're going to be a grandmother, like four or five times. Oh, my gosh. That was, I was like, guy is really excited <laughs> because i you know I, i'm already a, a, a mima or a grandma however you want to call me and i really didn't want to be another one right away and so i was trying not to bring the bring you i guess in this case down because you seemed really excited uh-huh. but i was like okay I am in shock right now, and I'm supposed to be excited about being a grandmother. i got to figure this out, but I don't want to hurt this guy's feelings. So I don't funny. want to do it. Honestly, the, the inside look so, into your um, thought process has been very entertaining to hear. I was wondering, honestly, as I'm like saying these things, I was like, is she not thinking this is strange? I was literally, I, mean, I live in an apartment, and I'm screaming this grandmother line, and I'm wondering, like, my neighbors must just think I'm the strangest person. <laughs> <laughs> well, and the thing was, is, is I kept thinking, you know, I don't know, because there's so many different types of people out there and personalities. You're like, well, you know, I hear I was laughing my head off when you're talking. You're like, oh, you're like giggling. And I thought, yeah, that's a Zachary line, you know. Uh-huh. And then all of a sudden you're like, Victoria Juarez. And I thought, well, crap. She yeah. knows her last name. I don't even know her last name. You, <laughs> you like, backpedaling okay. afterwards? You backpedaling yeah. afterwards and saying, oh, I'm, I'm yeah, so sorry. I'm so funny. sorry. It was, it was really funny. <laughs> um, it was so, a good good prank after I found, because I really was, after I hung up with you, I have to admit, I, I was starting to stew because I thought, if this is not a joke, if this is not a joke, uh-huh. <laughs> That's hilarious. Well, I, again, I, I am very so, sorry for getting you worked up like that, but I thank you for being a great sport. So since now you're in on the prank and got to enjoy the experience, I'm curious, though. So you've experienced an ownage prank firsthand. What are your overall thoughts? Well, it takes a certain kind of person to take a prank like that and not be ticked off for a while. After this the this is true. Looking back at the experience now that you know it's a prank and you're in on it, did you find it funny? Yes. In hindsight, it is very I'm, funny. I'm very <laughs> yes. And all I'm hoping, all I'm hoping for is that this. Looking up- back on the experience, Russell, do you find my return prank? Funny? Oh man, I know for sure. I told you, I gave you props. Like it was, it was disappointing and slightly upsetting, but at the same time, I can't complain. Like I, I'm getting a dish right back at you, so <laughs> it's it's totally fair. That doesn't happen very often. So like honestly, I didn't know how to react. It was a very like it was a it was a battle. It was a battle between being like sensitive to the, to the potential serious situation or calling out what might be just right. some fake. That was, but over, more than anything, I'm happy that you're okay um you're you're a super cool mom for, for taking that the way you did i i appreciate it and uh hopefully this will be like a funny well, Russell, it wasn't very much directed towards you as my son so <laughs> that's him i really wanted to get back in the process with the son so totally uh, no no hard feelings or anything like that um at all but i do have to run because i really did have a meeting at 6 30 
Uh-huh. Oh, no, 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 I, I totally understand. Well, thank, thank you so much for your time. Thank you, Zach. And uh, that was super funny. Send my regards to, uh, to the, your husband as well. <laughs> He's a, a, a budding little prankster. I will. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, I will. <laughs> you have a All good right. evening. Take care, everyone. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good God. At least you have to come up with a thousand dollars so that I can go ahead and forward this issue to the courthouse. Yeah, but I'm just wondering, you know, like even though like my son, you know, he's in the hospital, he's dying right now, you know, like don't you think the government will have sympathy about that? You know, he's he's actually dying.